My name is Elizabeth Severino and I am 20 years old. I used to be a student here at Rocking the Boat and now I am one of the on-water daytime program assistants. I want to introduce you to the education part of our oyster restoration project at Rocking the Boat. We take our students out to the Bronx River to show them the ecosystem and oysters and explain to them the role of the oysters in this urban river. Rocking the Boat teaches students about the river and the urban environment through restoration activities and environmental monitoring. Oyster restoration is one of our most exciting projects. When we go to visit the oyster gardens and oyster reefs, our students monitor the growth rate and the oysters and record the data. We take our boats out and take a 20 minute row on this urban river, passing a factory on our left and a park to our right. On our way to visit the oysters, we explain to our students that an adult oyster can filter 50 gallons of water a day. Once we reach the mouth of the river, our students and educators pull our oysters out of the water and muck into our boats and start recording the population and size of their organisms. Aside from being cluttered with all these organisms in our rowboats, we find some other friends, like crabs and fish, which tend to be stuck in these cages. We always make sure to tell our students how important these oysters are for the urban community. Oysters clean the river and also provide habitat for other animals. And a thriving community needs a clean, healthy river. Using oysters, Rock in the Boat teaches our students and the community that nature and our society can live together in the urban environment.